Welcome back to the Finding Your Way with Google Maps series. When trying to find the best way to get from point A to point B, you may want to consider traffic in your Google Map direction searches. When you get driving directions, you'll see the distance you'll be traveling, as well as an approximate time that it will take you to get there. Clicking on the traffic option will show you current traffic conditions for major highways in the area you'll be traveling. This guide shows that if traffic is green, that it's traveling over 45 miles per hour. If it's yellow, it's going slower. And if it's in the red, or the red and black, it's pretty much at a standstill. Right now we're looking at live traffic. You can change that traffic to a specific day and time. This isn't going to be 100% accurate but it will show what traffic is normally like on these days and times. If you really don't like what you're seeing, then you can drag the line of direction around on the map to find a better route. Besides traffic information, you can also point your mouse over the More options and choose to view photos from the area and see Wikipedia entries about locations around the area. You can click on them to view them right on the map, and close them as needed. Remember, there are 10 parts to this series, so don't forget to check out the other episodes in the Finding Your Way with Google Maps series.